I've always wondered, are we putting guys too young into this? Mm -hmm. Shouldn't it be older men who have had some established training and have have at least been in the ministry for some period of time to take on a church planning work? I'd love your thoughts on that. Well, I remember back when I was starting and we started a committee in our classes 2008, 2009, it was up and running. I didn't start that committee, but someone spoke into that that committee's discussion saying that in the Christian Reformed Church, it was the case, at least in the past, that they wouldn't send a man until he had had a call to an established church. Right. I don't know how that was yeah. formulated, whether it was just common practice. Mm-hmm. Um, I'm a big proponent of internships, mm-hmm. and I think there are very poor on-ramps into ministry mm-hmm. from seminary into life of the church in the URC right. because of our history of soul pastors right? Um, without assistance, without associates in so many of our churches. So young guys coming out of seminary have uh, small vacant churches, very few assistant pastor positions to move into to say grow and develop, not enough internships. Um, and so I think a lot of young guys feel called to the mission field or to church planning because it's a job option. And yeah, I think and, that's and right. that's one I of the many right. ways that I think our view of church planting is planter centered and not church centered yeah. in the sense that, oh, Fred has a call to, you know, Oklahoma City or someone has a passion here. And mm-hmm. I'm the like my my proposed book, we were joking, yeah. is, is yeah. how not to plant a church or how not to plant a reformed <laughs> church, because every yeah. chapter is a mistake I've made. Yeah. And in D.C., I and some friends uh, looked around. So we had a small group of folks, but we looked around and we saw a need. And it was totally grassroots. We we reached out then to a church and said, would you, could we do a work here? How could we oversee yeah. it? But, and, and that's going to happen sometimes. Yeah. Um, yeah. Lots of caveats here. Every church plan is going to mm-hmm. be different. And sometimes mm-hmm. that'll go. But I think when you do get that guy with a vision or a desire, it's important early on to harness him to right. an overseeing church. Mm-hmm. 